Hello and welcome to another episode of As Told by Gonzo. Thank you so much for returning. Today I'm going to be reviewing the movie Waves, directed by Trey Edward Schultz, who also directed It Comes at Night. Waves just drops us in the middle of this family, and we witness their very highs and their very, very dark lows. And what I really appreciate about Waves is every single shot, every single bit of dialogue, every performance, and every piece of music in this movie is very, very well done and has a purpose. The way that Schultz moves the camera, depending on what a certain character is going through, is phenomenal. For example, the aspect ratio changes a lot during this movie, and it all depends on what the character is going through. It could go from like a flat one by 85 by one, and then it quickly goes to a wide, uh, wide, like a very much a widescreen format, like a two by 35 by one, like, a like an Avengers movie, very cinematic. But then towards the middle, it goes to a one thirty three by one. And that adds a lot of, I guess, uh, tension, like done subtly that it just doesn't affect the viewing, but it has a really good impact once you go and rewatch it again. Kelvin Harrison Jr., who also worked on It Comes at Night, really carries the movie very, very well. Um, everybody in this movie is really, is really good. Lucas Hedges, I wish he was in the movie more. The story structure is very different. Um, about an hour and ten minutes in, it kind of turns like a 180, and it's you're, it's almost like you're watching a different film. Um, to be honest, and I really appreciated that about Waves is you think you're going into this kind of melodramatic Tyler Perry kind of family drama, but it's totally different from that. All these characters are very relatable, rather you're a parent, a teenager, any sort of age, there's something in Waves that you could relate to. And that's what I really appreciate about this movie is it's so relatable. Waves deals with a lot of grief, a lot of loving, a lot of forgiveness, a lot of like depression and anxiety, knowing how to move on with life. And just because something really bad happens doesn't mean that you should stop living. That literally waves, no point intended, life is like waves where it's, you have your highs and your lows and it's all about grieving and moving on and life doesn't stop just because you have issues and you're going through something horrible and awful doesn't mean life stops it keeps going on music is done by trent reznor and atticus ross they're very ambient oriented um uh music makers they did the soundtrack for mid 90s uh, gone girl and uh, another uh, david fincher movie the social network the soundtrack also features kanye west frank ocean a lot of pop a lot of r&b a lot of rap cannot recommend waves enough it's phenomenal it's great thank you so much for watching this video uh, and i'll see you guys next time